There are so many components to a hurricane. It's not like landfall is where it is only. I mean, we're dealing with tornado warnings. We have been all day long. Look what's going on right now. I bring it back. The eye is still offshore, but it's continuing to push its way on in. The winds have already started picking up. I mean, look, here's all the tropical alerts. Basically, the entire state of Florida, for the most part, has either a hurricane warning, tropical storm warning. It's going to be around for the next day or so. This is the severe thunderstorm watch box with active tornado warnings on the eastern side of the state. So it is very, very active. So you have all kinds of components to a hurricane. You have the winds that you're seeing like this in this picture. You have the severe weather. You have, uh, of course, the rainfall flooding, but we want to show you something. Let's talk about the most deadly part of this, and that is the storm surge flooding. So here in the next weather sphere, we like to give you a little bit of a different look in ways that you can visualize things. So we're going to use this house, which is basically to scale. Now notice here, we have this surge coming up at three feet. Now picture when the surge is at three feet, it's up to the door. If you decided to stay, you are no longer getting in your car. You're no longer driving away. You're not walking to your neighbor's house. You are stuck inside that house at three feet. Yeah, that's at three feet. Let's take it on up to six feet, okay? Now you have things floating around. Your trash cans there, they're floating around, pieces of wood, you name it. Your bottom floor of your home, completely washed out. You must go upstairs. If you're in a single story house, you have a big problem. Okay, you are up into the attic and into the rafters. And again, this is at six feet. Let's take it even more dramatic. Let's take you all the way up to a 10 foot storm surge. Now, if you're in a single story house, your bottom is completely covered. You are definitely in the attic. You're not on the roof because there's a hurricane going on in your upper floor. Even then, you may have the water going all the way up to the second story. And obviously to scale, you could see that this is unsurvivable if you are not in that area. And that's why they say get on out. And that's at a 10 foot storm surge. I want to show you the most recent numbers here and the forecast from the National Hurricane Center when it comes to the storm surge potential here. This just came down and here's where we stand. These bright colors, there's actually a storm surge forecast of nine to 13 feet higher than that. Some of the two story houses is going to be up well into the second floor. Tampa area, six to nine feet now, eight to 12 around Fort Myers. That's why we're looking at this as just a monster. And those people that chose to stay, that is a poor, poor choice to say the least. Even on the eastern side of the state, there's going to be some storm surge flooding. So that's what we're going to be watching for you.